Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel, it's great to have you here. So recently I've been spending a lot of time tinkering with an Arduino kit which I bought off of Amazon. I've put a link in the description below, it's a really good kit that's really well thought out. So anyway, since then I've been having a lot of fun with this Arduino, but I've come across one problem. So guys, as you can see I've got a large collection of jumper cables here. I feel like jumper cables are one of those things you can never have too much of. But what is difficult is when you're looking for the right type and they're all jumbled around somewhere and it just makes things that much more difficult. So, in this video, what I'm going to be going through is a simple solution that I've devised to help organise my jumper cables. Namely, into three categories. Male to male, male to female, and female to male. And then that way, the next project that I do and I need some jumper cables, I'll be able to find them a lot easier. Right guys, so let's go through the design that I have in mind. So here's a standard jumper cable and it's got really three main bits. You've got the thin wire in the middle and then you've got two slightly thicker terminals at the end. So the design that I'm thinking has a few small slots that the wire can go into, but those slots are too thin for the terminals, which means it will keep everything in place. So this design is actually inspired by the dental instrument cassettes we use at work. They, are, they follow a similar design principle. I'll put a picture up just now and that's where i'm drawing inspiration from once we've got everything made i'll jazz up the design a little bit to make it a little bit nicer to look at so that's the plan with that said we're going to jump into fusion 360. this is going to be a speed run of me doing the modeling so if you'd like to see a full tutorial please drop a comment down below and i'll be happy to put one out but for now let's hop over into fusion 360 and get started Right guys, so here are the finished jumper wire organizers. I'm really happy with how these turned out, but there's definitely a few tweaks I'd want to make going forward. In terms of what went well, the design's really nice and minimal. It doesn't require a lot of filament, and the way it's been designed, it means that you don't need support material either, which is always handy. It does what it says on the tin, it keeps the cables nice and organized, and overall it's a really simple and elegant design. There's definitely room for improvement though. Going forward, what I'd like to do is make the slots a little bit longer and have more slots so that the cables aren't as bunched together. I'd also like to fit some sort of locating mechanism, maybe something mechanical, like a dowel type joint, or even something magnetic, which I think would work really well. All in all, I'm happy with the way these turned out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider liking, subscribing, and leaving a comment down below as it really helps the channel grow. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you next time.